hello friends welcome back to the new tutorial of the angular so today we are going to learn how to restrict up to the two decimals in a input field okay so you can also use your javascript also and you can also but i'm today i'm just doing it in the angular part right so you can use it in the javascript also okay so those who haven't subscribed my channel yet please do subscribe my channel and if you like the video please do like it okay so let's get started so let me open the VS code for that and opening the angular project okay here we go where is add this is book listing okay this is book detail this is add book component okay so we were going to use this one price okay we will use this part so here we have an input class this and I'm going to use uh, key down so let's add e down and here I'm going to use function let me word wrap this okay so here I'm going to use uh, validate and here I'm going to pass dollar event right down validate so it's one places two places why it's three places it should be like this okay so it's done moving to the next part let's go for the add book add book component dot ts okay so here we are going to create a function okay so here we go with uh, use validate okay and here I'm going to add the code of mine so this is the validate function so here we are just receiving the event but it's a declare it's never used okay so it's gonna be like event event dot target target dot value okay so here I'm going to add event dot target dot value so it's not gonna be used here what it says any okay let's add the typescript it's so it's put any over here okay and uh, this is event dot target the t and all this this stuff this is this is issue so save this okay index off and uh, let's check what exactly it's doing where we go with terminal it's compiled go for it price but it's like it's three digits we need to restrict with the two digits right so here we, uh, where we go with this where is the VS code and uh, there is three make it two okay. let's see price 12.90 if I'm going to add any of the thing we can make an alert on that okay so here we go with we can add a new key, uh, case over here so I'm going to add this part I'm going to put result here and what it says validate if else on this 
put parts return a value okay so it's return to is this put value we can make a lot wrong uh, only allowed two digits after decimals okay so i'm going to add this part decimals let's have a look but not all the car path return the validate if and then okay so it's a return Here go and it is this one. Mm. Okay, let's see. I'm going to add a price. point ninety only two digits allowed of a decimals if I go and add one again only two digits are allowed see so this is how you can just add the validation like you can restrict the any of the input field after the two decimals if there is a requirement of that one okay so you can use like this so any doubt any query in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day